Hello everyone, in today's video, I am going to show you how to install Windows 10x on your Windows using Hyper-V. And I'm also going to give you an overview of Windows 10x. My name is Talha and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro really, really fast. Let's get started. Windows 10X is a new operating system specially designed for light devices. It is compact version of Windows 10. It is not officially released yet. However, we are going to go and show you the installation of it. First of all, we have to enable our Hyper-V manager and for that purpose, press Windows plus R button on your keyboard and then type option features.exe. A new window will open up. From here, look for Hyper-V Manager and from here, check the box of Hyper-V and make sure to check its subcategories too. So here you can see that mine, they are already checked. So if in your case, if it is not checked, make sure that you click on it and you check it. So the thing is that when you basically select or check this Hyper-V and its subcategories, it would take a while for the changes to take effect and then you have to restart your system in order for these changes to take effect. So the thing is that in some versions of Windows 10, you might not be able to find Hyper-V. In that case, you can externally download it or you can download it from any external link. On our Windows, we have the Hyper-V version, but if you do not have Hyper-V on the Windows 10 version of yours, then in that case, you can download it from the link. So we're gonna put the link in the description. You can click on it and you can download Hyper-V from there. Now go to the Microsoft official website and download the Microsoft emulator. The link of it is given in the description. It will open up the Microsoft store and you download Microsoft emulator from the Windows icon. And so here in the Microsoft store, you can see that it's loading. So here you can see that we have Microsoft emulator in front of us. Here you would see an install button if you want to install it. We have already installed it. So we see a launch button here so when you will install it you will also have a launch button so now we will click on this launch button and we'll launch the Microsoft emulator so here you can see that our Windows 10x emulator has been launched successfully so now you can see that we have downloaded the Microsoft emulator now we need to download the Windows 10x image okay so we download that image and then we'll run it on the Windows 10X emulator. So when you will click on the link that we have given in the description for the Windows 10X emulator, you will reach to the Windows Store on a page something like this, which shows Windows 10X emulator. So the thing is that you can download this image and for that there would be an install button that you would click and from there onwards you can install it. Here you can see that I have already installed it. So here I would click on the install button right here. If I click on it, it would start to install Windows 10x emulator image. So once you have downloaded the Windows 10x image, now the next step is that you go to your emulator and it would automatically detect the Windows 10x image. So for that, I would type in here Microsoft emulator and I'd open up the Microsoft emulator app. And from here, you can see that it has automatically detected the Windows 10x emulator image. So I'll click on the start button and then it would start the installation process for Windows 10x. So here you can see that the installation process has started and now it would take a while. So here you can see we had the message of OS is starting and now we have the Hyper-V and it is loading. So Windows 10X installation process has started through the Windows 10X image emulator and now all we have to do is wait a little, maybe for 10, 20 minutes and then the installation process will be finished. So here you can see that now Windows 10X has started. How do I know? If I press the Windows button on my computer, it would start to show me 
Windows apps right here. So here you can see that this is an emulator and you can run two apps simultaneously and see and view both of them on these both screens. So let's talk about what is Windows 10X. It is a new operating system designed for light PCs and smartphones, but it is not a next version of Windows 10, which many of us are using right now. If you are thinking that you will get an update of Windows 10X from Windows 10, then it's not gonna happen. You won't get any Windows 10X update on your Windows 10. It is more consolidated and simpler version in terms of functionality and specifications as compared to earlier Windows versions. We cannot install the third-party apps in it like VLC Media Player, third-party antivirus, etc. But it's been said that it will start to support the legacy apps in upcoming series or upcoming versions. If we talk about local accounts, we cannot create the local accounts in it yet which means that we have to log in using our Microsoft accounts, like your Hotmail accounts or Outlook accounts. In terms of its usability, taskbar has been placed in the center and there is no option for quick launch yet. Options for Wi-Fi, volume and other stuff is at almost same place like Windows 10. So click on the time and menu will pop up. The power option is moved to the action center as it is on the left bottom in the Windows 10. We can lock our screen and go to the settings from here as well. We can do nothing much with the taskbar as we can only change its appearance a little bit. Go to settings and here look for personalization. Click on personalization and then click on the taskbar. Choose any size you want. In Windows 10X, we have the Microsoft Edge as the browser. So it has like online office feature and you can maybe go to the internet and search your favorite things. You could download them. When we talk about the main menu, there are no menu like tiles. There is list of menus and recent program at one place. As we know that search bar was at the bottom in Windows 10, but in Windows 10X, it has been shifted to the top and it will only appear when we go to the menu. From this search about, we can search the files and the programs in the system. And even the web can be searched from here. So if I wanna search anything like related on the internet, I could do so. So if I search here cat, so it would search the cat on the internet and it would give me the result. Let's talk about the security. In Windows 10X, we have more security as we cannot access the system partitions, which means that if a file or folder gets affected, it won't be able to affect or damage the system files, which is pretty good in itself. Whenever we open any app in the Windows 10X, it will open in full screen mode. For example, if we open calculator in Windows 10, it will open up on screen. However, here you can see that in Windows 10X, it will open on full screen. There is no option for small screen on Windows 10X. While on Windows 10, you had an option to make the app smaller or greater. So if I were to conclude my remarks, Windows 10X is best to use on tablets as it is feasible to use it with finger and touch. If we talk about its design, it is more feasible for tablets than the PC. So hope you have enjoyed this video and the review of Windows 10X. Now you know how to install it and how to start using it on your Windows 10. You can download the Windows 10X emulator and image from the links given in the description. So that's it from this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel to get the latest videos to help you advance your IT career.